The message from the COP26 climate conference was clear. We know what the scientists tell us and we have learned not to ignore them. It's one minute to midnight on that doomsday clock and we need to act now. An action came in the form of more than 100 countries signing a landmark pledge to reduce methane emissions by 30% by 2030. That's significant because methane is the second biggest cause of global warming behind carbon dioxide. Australia, along with major emitters, China, Russia and India, did not sign the Global Methane Pledge. But Australia did sign a second pledge to end deforestation by the same date. Dr Kate Dooley is a research fellow at the University of Melbourne's Climate and Energy College. She says as a signatory of the new declaration, Australia must strengthen land clearing laws end native forest logging and restore degraded ecosystems. Australia also confirmed its 2050 target to reach net zero emissions. Driving down the cost of technology and enabling it to be adopted at scale is at the core of the Australian way to reach our target of net zero emissions by 2050 that we are committing to at this COP26. Here's how Australia's emissions from all sources have been tracking. They were higher in 2007 than at any point in the previous two decades. After 2007, they fell every year until 2017, when they again started climbing. Emissions have dropped since 2019, in part due to the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic. But those figures only include emissions within Australia. Under international protocols, countries aren't accountable for emissions embodied in their fossil fuel exports. And Australia is the world's largest exporter of coal and liquefied natural gas. A large number of governments and financial institutions reported to the climate talks that they intend to stop funding projects that promote fossil fuels by the end of 2022. In my lifetime, I've witnessed a terrible decline. In yours, you could and should witness a wonderful recovery. That desperate hope, ladies and gentlemen, is why the world is looking to you and why you are here.